You can hold up your sign and wave your banner and celebrate graduation for some local kids. Reverend Gino Merriweather is the secretary for the Southern Indiana Mentoring Academy, and he's here to celebrate those Lincoln kids. It's so nice to have you on the show. Well, thank you very much for having me. This is a great story to tell. So let's talk about the event, and we'll talk a little bit more about SEMA. But, so the event's the 24th. That is correct. The 24th, as it's coming Tuesday. Now, what's going to happen is there's going to be a graduation program at okay. the school. At school, okay. And then right after that, about 11 o'clock, we're going to assemble outside, and then we're going to have a parade. <laughs> we're going to have a good old-fashioned New Orleans-style parade. We're going to have the kids with banners and flies and all that kind of thing. And there's going to be a drummer. Oh, yeah. And then we're, going to go ahead, we're going to begin the parade. We're going to march all the way down uh, Garvin Street until we get right about Walnut area. And then we're going to circle around and come back and we're going to complete our parade at the African American Museum. And at that time, there's going to be some men from SEMA and other people, other places. We're going to be talking to the kids, encouraging them, their refreshments. And then it gives us an opportunity to kind of mingle with parents, uh, faculty, and the kids all together. Um, and that's what it's going to be. We look forward to it. It'll be a lovely time. experience. Yeah. Have you ever done this before? Here? Not here. Okay. Not here in California. We did some things similar to this, but not like this. This is going to really be an opportunity to celebrate graduation. But it's deeper than that because really what happens is we are celebrating, you know, achievement. Of course. For so many times we just kind of graduate through without bringing any fanfare to it. Now we say we need to accentuate what's going on with the kids and every, not only the eighth graders, but then those uh, grades that are coming up behind them begin to have something to look forward to, a sense of anticipation, which is going to spill over in a greater concentration on, you know, uh, academics, achievement, you know, and just being a good, honest student. Oh, yeah, they're going to look at that and go, I want that. <clears throat> exactly. I want to be a part of that. Now, can yeah. the public join this celebration? Oh, absolutely. As a matter of fact, we're going to be encouraging you know, not only uh, parents uh, and uh, faculty, but the, it's a community uh, parade, and it's even titled, you know, the uh, Community Graduation Parade. So we're really soliciting, you know, input and buying in from the whole community. It will be something to take part in. It won't take long. It's not a big time commitment. Not a big time. And be lots and lots of happy kids. Right. A lot of excitement, a lot of enthusiasm. And then as it begins to spill over into community participation, we can begin to build on that. So we need some things to build on. And I think this is going to be a great achievement. You know, but not in a vacuum. We put it right there uh, on the spotlight for display so everybody can share in the achievement. And then it gives the kids things to uh, look forward to and then want to achieve other things because of recognition. Well, and that's the work of SEMA. This is the Mentoring Academy. And you're, you know, well connected at these schools. And what's the role, your overarching role at SEMA? <laughs> right, right. Initially, you know, we are a mentoring academy. We want to uh, mentor, you know, young kids, particularly kids who, well, all kids, but sometimes there are certain populations uh, that need more hands-on attention there than others, okay? So first of all, we're making a presence, number one, a presence. Uh, we first started off this day going into cafeterias, but that has morphed into not only a presence, but an opportunity to begin to cultivate, you know, relationships with the children, and then make inroads and begin to uh, have interaction with the parents as well. And then what happened, we've been doing community gardens and a lot of other things uh, that have given that hands-on experience, which allows us to come alongside the kids, not just be a superintendent watching over kids, but to come alongside of kids with interactive activities, uh, which uh, allows them to open up and share, and then that's where the rubber really meets the road, if you will, because that's where we can begin to share some substantive, you know, uh, information along with proper modeling. And it's so important. So if you want to learn more about SEMA, they can go to your Facebook page, Facebook call. Page. I know you're always looking for more men to mentor. We're, we're always trying to recruit. We understand that, you know, the thing that you achieve in life contributes to your success. But then when you begin to pour into others, then you move to another level of not success, but significance. And we're calling on other men to make a significant, have significance and make an indelible impression on our young people today. And I'm going to say amen, brother. Thank you, Gina. Thank you.